foolish mortals. All right, this time I, John, will draw first. Um, we're doing two of these because we had a lot of fun doing the last one, and yeah. I, John and I looked at each other and we we're like, "Fuck it, it's our goddamn channel." See, so. the thing I don't. This is kind of like a pseudo podcast thing. At the beginning of every podcast, they always like explain what they do again. Like they always have like the intro bit where they explain whatever they're talking about or mm-hmm. whatever, even if it's the, what they do the whole time. So, do you want to <laughs> do that again or what? No, no, no. Well, in the last episode, we were saying we were going to, you know, see the votes and then announce a winner if we did another one of these or whatever. But we're doing another one of these like two seconds after we said that. Yeah. So I just wanted to clarify to everyone that we have not even aired the episode with the last set of votes. So we don't have an answer for you today. Yeah. We will have an answer for you eventually. I cannot promise when that will occur. (laughs) Real quick for anyone who didn't watch the other episode. We're playing a game called Super Fight where we each draw... Uh, three character cards and three ability cards, and we each pick one of each of those and then get a random ability, and we both have to argue who would win in a fight between these two characters. And then at the end, you guys will get to decide who wins. Well. So well. yeah, you know, if you're interested in that, go back and uh, watch the first episode of this and give us a vote on that, <laughs> because... We need some fucking votes, probably. <laughs> yeah, comment in the bottom of the video and tell me who you think would win. I was going to make a poll, but it's more fun if you guys comment. Yeah, because then we have to physically count it. (laughs) Well, you make it sound like work. Well, when's the poll close? Like, when do we decide we're done? When the next video goes up. This video's... Okay. I mean, the next one after this one. All right. um, Let's see. (laughs) I want to pick one of these just because I think it's funny. But... (laughs) We'll have to see. I'm picking this one. <laughs> I've got one that I definitely think is funny. I'm picking the one that's funny. I'm not picking the one I think that would be best in the fight. I'm picking the one that I think okay. is the funny. <laughs> All right. Since you're, you're just putting that out there, I'll pick the one I think is funnier rather than the one All I right. think would be better. All right. I'm going to draw my second ability in y'all. <laughs> you want to go first? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> My fighter is a child beauty pageant queen. Nice. Who has a hostage. <laughs> and her entire body is very sticky. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> well, you might like this, then. Okay. <laughs> I chose werewolf. <laughs> that shoots bees from its mouth. <laughs> and the one I drew just says super donkey punch. <laughs> I feel like I got this. You win. <laughs> Best case. I was going to be like, you can't touch me because I'm underage. Like, you're in a situation and I'm sticky. Like, this is looking real weird for you, man. You're going to want to back off. <laughs> I don't even need the hostage. Uh, think about how shitty this is for the hostage. <laughs> He's got like the sticky child pageant, like in a head. He's got her. Or she's got your hostage in the headlock. <laughs> And then in comes this werewolf vomiting bees everywhere. <laughs> it was a real day for Jim. <laughs> then, then the werewolf and the beauty pageant kid both look at this hostage and go like, No one will ever believe you. <laughs> Tell whoever you want, we don't care. Alright, I'm gonna... So that was our warm-up round? <laughs> yeah, let's do another one. Alright. Shit, I do too many. Didn't look at this. All right. It's really tempting to pick the one that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, God. I like my list of cards I have here. <laughs> Man, this would have been really good against the werewolf. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's, yeah. Once again, I'm going to pick the funny one I have to. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. I have a card here that says, can control hair. It's like, where were you when I was fighting the werewolf? You're going to wish you kept that. <laughs> oh, man. The two I got rid of were Moose and Ultimate Fighting Champion. 
<laughs> All right. <laughs> oh fuck! I'm Mine, fucked. Mine's awesome. All right. What or do you got? I'm having a good time. <laughs> what do you got? Okay. Well, I chose Conan. Okay, that's. I, I assume the barbarian. I assume O'Brien. <laughs> if it meant Conan the barbarian, it would have said Conan the barbarian, right? I guess so. Yeah. Okay. So I'm I'm picking then, and I'm picking Conan O'Brien. <laughs> okay, you got rid of MMA fighter for that. Yeah, because you know I'm, and you got rid of can control hair. So I think <laughs> I think I did it right. Okay. Anyway, Conan's special ability is that he can summon and command dildos. <laughs> The card I drew is Has No Bones. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Well, I've got a boy band. I'm going to go with Backstreet Boys. All right. Uh, the one that I picked was Can Take the Form of Anything Water Base. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and the card I drew is Has an Invisibility Cloak. But just one. <laughs> so they have to share it. Which I'm assuming is the reason they will inevitably break up. All right. I think I got a shot here. Okay, take your shot. We'll see what you got. I realize I'm I'm Conan O'Brien with no bones at this point. But I think with his ability to command and summon dildos, I think he can like make like an exoskeleton. <laughs> it's like Wolverine, he's got like dildo claws. <laughs> right. Or he's just sitting there like a, he's like drooped into a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> and then he sees you come in here controlling water. Well, I guess he wouldn't see you because you haven't. Well, you have one invisibility cloak. That's our surprise factor. We're going to put it on one guy. It's like the surprise factor. <laughs> or like all of you are like under it. I like, can see your feet. <laughs> <laughs> but we're doing choreographed dancing on the way to the battle. So anyway, uh, my strategy is going to be that I can summon and command dildos to form like a dildo robot mecha. <laughs> So the having no bones doesn't matter. It's just less things for you to break. <laughs> okay. And, uh, yeah, okay. That's that's all I've got. Okay. My plan here is to have four of the five Backstreet Boys take on the form of some, you know, water-based, I don't know, fucking icicles and, and fucking, I don't know, water. <laughs> just buckets of water. <laughs> An attack head on to fight Coden, but the fifth Backstreet Boy will come from above and climb up like Shadow of the Colossus style in his invisibility cloak, unbeknownst to Conan. It'll be like the dark and gritty Backstreet Boy whose name I don't remember, Arian or whatever his name is. Yeah, it'll be that one. <laughs> you know, the real Edge Lord fucking Backstreet Boy. He'll sneak up top Backstreet Boy. <laughs> to, to, to the helmet area and then become a pool of water that seeps into the dildo mecha and tries to drown boneless dildo Conan inside of his arm. <laughs> While he fights the rest of the back street. Boys. Surprise to you, you've fallen into my trap. <laughs> All right, what's your trap? Boneless Conan was never in the mecha. Oh, shit. <laughs> he was controlling it remotely <laughs> from this other harmless pile of dildos in the corner. <laughs> We've been had. <laughs> and now you're stuck inside this uh, dildo mecha as it slowly crushes you. <laughs> It becomes really compact water. This puff of steam comes out of the field over there. Uh, okay. Well, having realized this, the four remaining Backstreet Boys <laughs> will make a beeline for Dildo Fortress Conan. You forget now. I have your invisibility cloak. Oh, shit. I will have a small detachment of dildos. <laughs> Bring it to Boneless Conan. And then they're going to roll me to safety like how they used to move bricks in ancient Egypt. <laughs> All the while, it's going to make like this slurping, like flopping sound. I don't have any bone. Using our musically honed sense of hearing, <laughs> we will follow the slurping sound. <laughs> And as one by one the Backstreet Boys are picked off running and screaming through this field by the Mecha Dildo, one will finally reach Conan, rip off the cloak, and crush his cold ginger heart. As the life fades from Conan's body, he'll say, For Aaron. <laughs> <coughs> 
Ow. You decide who wins. Have you ever laughed so hard your balls hurt? <laughs> Uh, 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 see you guh- guys in a week, I guess. <laughs> 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 <laughs>